Business retention and expansion is a uh, project that the University of Minnesota created many years ago. Um, it's a way for communities to work closely with their, uh, their businesses. For government, especially, it, it points out if there's any red flag issues. There's nothing worse for a town leader than to see a for sale sign or a going out of business sign. He didn't really know anything about it. Let's figure out if there's any issues. How can we work together to solve what those issues are? The Tri-City Marketplace has a very diverse economy. We can strengthen the Tri-City Marketplace while still maintaining our identity. Each of these farms is their own business. We want them to succeed as well. As a business owner in the Tri-City Marketplace, uh, you'll find the, the newest second phase of the br &E study coming around to you. Please take 15 minutes to fill this out. It's important information for us to learn about ourselves and to continue to not only develop new businesses, but again, to retain what we have. We've got a nice market here. With our combined efforts, we can help each other. I encourage you to return your br &E survey by January 29th so that you can be entered into the drawing for a ticket to the Entrepreneurial Bridge Conference held in Mankato and sponsored by Smith. It's vitally important that, that the surveys that are mailed out, that they get filled out uh, honestly and that they're sent back. That information is all confidential. So important with this second round of surveys is that we do get feedback from all of our businesses so we can work together to hear their needs to make them successful and to also plan to get new businesses into our area. Rushford, Rushford Village and Rushford Peterson. This is a true tri-city marketplace all depending on each other to succeed. Agriculture, which is a big driver, of course, in the village. Plus, we have nanotechnology. We have precision machining, powder-coated metal products, a great service economy, many restaurants, local financial centers, pharmacies, grocery stores. All this contributes to the well-being of all of us who live in this community.